I am asleep on the beach. Now I'm awake. Let's go. First things first, I'm still sick. I was sick throughout half of season 130. Um, mild cough, congestion still just stuck with me. Been pretty much the same symptoms for over the past, eh, I don't know, like four days at this point. So to anyone new tuning in, just yeah, keep that in mind. I'm, I haven't been feeling the best recently. So if I make any mistakes, it's it's because I'm sick, okay? I, I am never to blame, all right? Green crate, boop, salvage Dax, okay. I'll take that. Man, there's actually, there's not too many crates that are left here, unfortunately. Okay, bow on the way, and then I'll make some bandages. I just need to start getting some stone for arrows. Throughout the entire past, well, the past season, and then the entirety of last month, pretty much, I haven't been going over to Oil Rig, and it's something that I do quite frequently, but I decided to take a little bit of a break from it. Some people wanted a break from Oil Rig, so I decided to do that. But considering, oh, dude, Metal Pickaxe, actually, that's big. But considering that uh, next update is going to include some, at least I think, it's going to include some uh, changes to Oil Rig, I thought that I should probably start getting that practice in, just so we're ready for it, you know? Dude, what is going on on this server? Oh my god. Alright, actually, do I have BPs on here? I wonder if I do. Oh, yeah, I actually do have a couple. But not like a crazy amount, so... Okay, I'm kind of down with that. Oh! Jesus! Oh, okay, I'm getting shot. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm getting shot from inside the grass. Do you hear me, okay? Do not be surprised if I end up strangling myself today, okay? Yeah, we're gonna probably need like 2,000 more wood and I'm gonna guess like 5, 6k more stone. So, yeah, hopefully we get all the nodes and shit that we need over here. It feels like nowadays I'm not that tapped in with like the newer movies that come out. But I actually started watching that new uh, Willy Wonka movie. At least I think it's pretty new. And uh, I'm like halfway through it, kind of enjoying it. Not gonna lie. I kind of forget what the, the first one was like. Because I know that the first one was like a big deal, right? Like, like Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory or some shit it's called. And I know that I've seen it. It's just been so long. And I've probably only seen it like once or twice in my lifetime. So I might need to rewatch that actually. Okay, let's go. Now, like, when it comes to where I'm living, I don't know if I should just base, like, right near Fishing Village or what. Because cause I can either base right near Fishing Village, right? Or I can base more inland, but then just have a, a boat base by Fishing Village. And I don't know which one I should really do. I mean, shit, Dylan, look at this spot up here that you're at right now. You can fucking just live up. Oh, my God. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if you should live above this, but... <laughs> yeah, Dylan, you will get raided. Do not do that. Maybe I can't live, like, right on... I mean, I'll try and live right on the water. I, I just... I wouldn't prefer to just get raided instantly. Because, uh, yeah. I probably will if I base right here. I'll find a spot. I'll find a spot. We're not gonna live right on the water, though, I don't think. We'll just have a separate boat base. Yeah, like, if I just, like... If I show up, like, up here... Can I just live here? I mean, like, I can live here, but... You know what? I think it's time to just put down my base just like right here. That's what it's time for. Yep. There we go. Alright, key lock here. Boom. I am going to go and use the restroom now. Okay, I'm now back. So, let's go ahead and add a wall right there. <laughs> Upgrade that to wood, wood door, key lock. Wait, where's the wood door at, huh? Aw, oh, shit, I need 300 wood. Damn, okay. Well, we got our base down first try, which is pretty cool. We'll take that. Nice. I am just going to make a small box, and then I'm going to get back out there and get a little bit more wood so I can get a second door down. The real question is, am I trying to hit up oil rate today? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. I mean, I'm going to be on the water looting components today. I know that. All right, I'm out of here. Go ahead and just make a wood door key lock. Then we got to get back home, put down this door, make a bag for inside. And then, I mean, just focusing up on a boat base instantly isn't really the worst idea. Usually a boat base comes later for me. I never work on it right away, though. 
but if I'm needing components and needing to like get started and shit, just getting a boat base down, then buying a boat and uh, looting the water, recycling at uh, different rad towns and shit that are on the water. I think that's gonna be the plan. I like that. So now we almost have enough scrap to buy a boat, but yeah, I mean, I guess that we should just do the shit that I just now said. Let's get outside. Let's get stone. Let's uh, let's make a freaking boat base. Now my boat base is gonna be down there next to the team that uh has the bigger base, but. Are they really going to raid a boat base? I would assume not, alright? And actually, I guess it doesn't matter here. I'm going to be getting metal and stone. Yeah. Because uh, as soon as it turns dark out, I'm going to leave with that salvaged axe and just get a shitload of wood. And then I'll come back home and uh, get metal cooking in the furnaces. That way we can get off of the full sheet vault today, hopefully, as well. Okay, and then we have the node right here that has no hotspot on it because it's inside the fucking rock. What the hell, game? What is this? What is this silly goosery? I'll still mine it up, though, because I need it. But yeah, this right here is the mining run. Not too shabby. Uh, I'm just going to need to go out and get a little bit more wood for a TC and whatnot. Then we can go build this boat base. And I think that I'm just going to have wood doors on it. I mean, I can't really change that because I don't have any metal for eggs at the moment. I guess... Yeah, let's also get two furnaces going right now, too. Hell yeah. There we go. Cool. And then by the time that I get back here with the wood, I should have enough metal cooked up to uh, put down a sheet door. Sorry, I, I have a hard time talking throughout this whole sickness thing. Because I just feel coughs just trying to come out as I'm talking because my throat's like, tick you know, just getting a little bit tickled whenever I talk. So, yeah, you guys might hear my voice fucking up here and there. <laughs> Not too bad. I think that I might come out here and just get a... Am I going to need a little bit more than that today? I don't know. Honestly, I feel like this right here might just be enough for the day. I'm just going to stick with this for now. If I need more, I'll get it later. Alright, sheet door down. Cool. I am going to leave and go and just start cooking up this crude oil. Now at the oil refinery that I live near. Because listen, okay? It's just the adult thing to do, okay, guys? we got to be mature with how we play. we got to be utilizing nighttime, okay? <laughs> Alright, that's all done cooking. Let's go. Now I'm gonna get up here, put this away, and then get the boat base made. Let's just do that as it's dark right now. I mean, uh, that might need to be something that's done at daytime, Dylan. But actually, yeah, it's becoming day. You're good. Yes, that'll work. I hope. Dude, I really hope that I'm gonna be able to get out of the freaking boat seat with this thing. Okay, so TC is going to go right there. This floor is going to get demolished. All right, cool. There we go. Day five hours. This right here is the boat base. All right. All that I know is that oil rig is taken right now, so I just know that that's where a lot of the action is going to be. I'm just going to take all these components with me, I guess. And then 125 scrap. Oh, f fishing village. You guys don't have the music going. What the fuck, man? Oh, no, there we go. Ah, yes. Okay. All right. We're going to be hearing that all wipe. Yeah, it's time to get out of here on the water, my friends. Actually, maybe I should go over to... Should I go loot harbor right now? I don't know. And actually, I see someone asked me in my Discord, I was watching your new, uh, your new video, and I have ADD and ADHD as well. I was wondering if from your experience if the pills made a big difference, or am I wasting my time? I mean, like, it got the job done that it needed to get done, you know what I mean? Like, it helped me focus. But it's like, the way that I think about it, like, if you just want to take those, you know, those pills just, like, as you're in school to just, like, help you hold focus and pay attention and all that, like... You can do it, you're just sacrificing other parts of yourself, which maybe that's fine to just get good grades for the time being, and just, you know, you could just kind of just feel like, hey, fuck the fun, fuck my personality, let's get these good grades and I'll get off this shit when I'm out, right? You could, I mean, you could play it like that, I just, I just did it, right? Like after, and, and like, I don't even remember how long I was taking those medications for ADD and ADHD for, but I just wasn't a fan of the trade-off to be able to pay attention, right? Which is, which means like, I'm not talking much and then I'm not gonna be eating much either. But, best believe, got the homework done in study hall, so 
I mean, it helped me in a way, <laughs> but then it also didn't help me in other ways. Actually, small oil rig is respawned right now. I almost want to go there just to see if anyone's there yet. Because it was gone when I checked the map a little bit ago. Yeah, I'm curious to see if anyone's there. I'm not going to counter, though, of course. We're just in grind mode right now, man. There's nothing else on my mind besides just grinding the fuck up and having a lot of shit to work with tomorrow. Having a solid base to work with tomorrow, resources to work with tomorrow. Cause, yeah, I don't know if people are going to be showing up here like instantly, but... I'm seeing a boat parked in front of the place. I'm seeing a weird oil rig base over there to my right. That's great. I don't think anyone's there yet. I don't think there is anyone there yet. Okay. Fuck, man. I wish that I had key cards and shit so that I could just go there and hold it down right now. I'm sure someone's going to show up there soon. Dude, if there is someone up here that, that has, like, a tier 2 gun and he kills me, like, I think that might be the point where I'm just like, okay, I retire. Okay, and I'm seeing a fucking dead guy here. This is not good. Okay, real quick, I'm gonna take a shortcut up, okay? To you guys that don't know this shortcut, I'm here to show you, alright? Climb up here, you get right here, then you just jump, like, right here. Boom, you're up. Alright, I've won some fights just from knowing that one way of getting up, but I think that we're good. We should be fine. Wait, there's like weird... Okay, I don't know. I dropped that right there. Dylan, what is wrong with you? But see, like, that right there is what I'm saying. It's little shit like that with like my ADD. To where like I just... I, like, like I forget for a moment. Like, if I was the one who dropped that, it's just kind of ridiculous. <laughs> like when I think about like the whole like ADD and ADHD thing, like... Because, you know, like, I feel like a lot of people that have it use it as, like, an excuse. I try to not even really think about it that much. Like, I don't want to identify myself, like, with that just repeatedly. Just because I feel like it might just make it worse. Because then it's like, not only do I have ADD, but just psychologically, I'm constantly telling myself that I have it as well. Which is only going to slow me down more, I feel like. And I feel like it just comes from, like, maybe, like, a place of gratitude. Just knowing that, like, hey, I mean, like, yeah, like, you have ADD, but you could have a lot worse than that. All right, bucko. Got 200 scrap on this run. Not that much scrap, but to be fair, we got like 300 crude oil and almost 900 cloth. It was a really good run. Ah, yes, here we are. Our, our boat base that's right next to a big-ass team. I love that. I mean, how can you not love that, guys? And I don't even know if this thing's even going to, like, properly go in here, like... Oh, no. Okay, I can, I can get off it. Thank God. Uh oh oh god it's not a good boat base stone it sucks all right i'm actually pissed i think that my next component run because i'm just going to keep on working my way up to like a tier two and whatnot my next component run is not going to be on the water i'm going to go like kind of inland try and get myself into some trouble as i'm out on a component run i'm just gonna i'm gonna be wanting to get a tier one bench down and get like a nail gun going from the side of this crossbow Keep that going. I only need probably like, I don't know, 3k frags to get this thing full sheeted up. So we're already almost done with that, which is big. And the tier one bench, I mean, I was thinking about putting it right here, but they took it, like, they took away the ability to get on a tier one bench and like jump on top of it. It used to be so easy and free to do, but then they're just like, you know, let's take that out of the game. Let's keep paddles at outpost as the only fucking tool that you can take out inside that safe zone, but let's, let's just change this you know let's just let's focus on silly shit it's like okay yeah i don't know it's like there's like some barrier that's like inside this thing now that makes it to where like you can't you can't jump on top of it as easily anymore actually wait, do i have molotov on this server i don't even know yeah i do you can always flame rate if we see any like good flame rate opportunities as well what sir the don't be walking next to me, Gustavo. Like, me and you are, like, best friends or something, okay? Oh, my gosh, dude. The leg over here in my area is absurd. Holy shit, dude. Dude, there's a lot of components on this road. Yeah. Hello, train yard. How's it going? Which, dude, I don't know, man. My love for Train Yard has been, like, non-existent ever since the bots got added uh, uh, over there. Like, th like, that's another whole thing, like, with these rad towns, man. Like, 
No wonder people are just at safe zones every fucking day, paddling and shit, because they add bots to safe zones, or the rad towns like this. Like, this is, this is nerfing rad towns when you do shit like that. And it's not like that's new, but, you know, like, they added bots here, they added bots inside the card room at airfield, they added bots in the card room at launch. And ever since then, the population at, the, uh, at, at these specific rad towns has definitely decreased, without a doubt. Because who wants to go to a fucking rad town and have to kill bots is, is like, your lower tier? That's why I never come here, because I'm not trying to show up and kill bots, and then the boys show up and fucking murder me because of it. Green crate. Ooh, hello there, Pumpy. How's it going, buddy? Yeah, so pretty much the plan now. I'm just going to go all the way back home, depot, and then I'm going to leave with, like, two of my fuses, and I'm going to go out and try getting all the key cards that I need. See, and it's like, to be fair, if I just lived by outpost, like, but by the water at the same time, I could just probably go there and buy everything that I need. A tier 2 gun, the key cards, everything, you know? Oh, shit. Oh. Fuck, dude. I'd love to try countering that. If it's just like a solo SAR guy, I'd love to counter that. Alright, well, made it back uh, with this run. Cool. Five springs. Wow. 116 scrap. That's not even with us recycling. Yeah, like after this component run, or uh, after this key card run, we're going to definitely have enough scrap to make a tier 2 bench. And then at that point, fuck, dude. Uh, I mean, we're going to be able to make pump slug. That's all that I know. And I don't know if I'm going to be going over to oil rig with that. I mean, I, I'm going to need a lot of slugs for that. Yeah, I just need to try and just push this entire boat out there. Oh, uh, yep, here we go. Here we go with this. Okay, yeah, this... I fucking hate my boat base. Can I just say that right now? Like, I really do hate this thing. Okay, I cannot push this thing. It's just, I'm fucked. Oh, okay. Um. Okay, I'm just gonna fucking pick up the door. Okay, that still isn't working. I'm just trying to start the fucking engine, dude. Oh my god. Dude, this is... Dylan? I don't know how I can not get this engine started. I'm getting so close to getting it. This is fucking insane. Dude, just let me fucking push the engine start button game, please. Okay, can I just fall off it and just push it? Thank you. Okay, Anna, we're good. We're good. Holy shit. There's already too much low grade in here, so I need to fucking go back in right now. <laughs> it's already daytime? Holy shit, dude. Yeah, I feel like today I'm just, I don't know, man, I'm just speed running, going to oil rig, that's like the whole plan. And I literally might go there and just die. Like, literally all this, like, well, I mean, it, all this grind is still worth doing. Like, we're going to be getting off of the good base and a tier 2 bench and and all that jazz, right, which is really good. But I'm going to be trying to go to, uh, go over to oil rig, I think, with pump slug, which I don't want to necessarily go with pump slug. It's just what I have researched on here. So, yeah, that's just kind of, that's just kind of our situation. At the same time, like, like, I, of course, love Slug. A lot of people know that about me, is that I love using Slug. Whether if it's DB Slug or Pump Slug, I love it. I just, uh... Going to Oil Rig with it is just kind of a bitch, man. I don't know. That's a lot of Slugs that I'm gonna need to kill bots, and that's that's the most annoying thing, but... And Slugs are expensive, GP-wise, and I'm not even cooking Sulfur. The moment that I get back home, I gotta start cooking up Sulfur, for sure. And I see someone ask me in my Discord, recently you've talked about your struggles with being on your A game, like exercise, diet, etc. I don't know how others are motivated because only they know how to motivate themselves. But I remember years ago you talked about how important it is to speak affirmations to oneself. Are you still doing them? And if not, can you do one right now? All love, brother man. Yeah, so I haven't really been doing it much anymore. That was definitely something in the past and it's still something that I think is a really healthy and good thing to do nowadays. Just like as you're laying in bed or right as you're getting up, just telling yourself out loud like 10 times, I am fearless, I am fearless, I am fearless, or, or like whatever the fuck it could be, right? It could be I am beautiful, it could be I am intelligent, it could be any of these things. And just telling yourself that over and over and over, like obviously that alone isn't going to like make you like just fearless, right? But it's going to make you move more toward fearlessness, I feel like, or more intelligence. That was actually one of the first things that I started doing that helped out my... Uh, like, my social skills, you know? Because it used to be really fucking bad, which it's still not in, like, the best spot, obviously. Because I don't go outside at all, you know? I'm as good at, at socializing as I am at basketball. I just don't do it, right? But I don't know, like, when I just started telling myself shit like, I am fearless, I have no anxiety, and just, just shit like that. Shit that your brain doesn't usually think. I just feel like when you're telling yourself, like, these affirmations out loud, it can really 
it can really impact um, who you are. Dude, it is so dark in here. What is this? Yeah, okay. We have all the key cards that we need now, man. Let's go. Let's get out of here. 230 scrap. Yeah, we definitely have enough for a tier a tier 2 bench now, which is dope. And I feel like mainly, you know, like the whole positive affirmation thing is really cool. But I feel like it mostly just comes down to, like, you just need to work on your vocabulary. I feel like working on your vocabulary is so important. Because I look at words as, like, spells. And, like, if you're constantly telling yourself that you are certain things... And what, whether if they're negative or positive, look at those as like spells that you're casting onto yourself. There's negative spells, positive spells, and what are you going to be casting onto yourself, right? What are you telling yourself every day? And whether if it's in your mind or out loud, whatever it is. You got to be careful, I feel like, with that. It, it, it's crazy how important it is, even though it kind of seems like it's in the background of everything. Oh god, and here we are. We're at the good old boat base that it just, it's, it, it's, it's a terrible boat base. <laughs> That's the thing, Dylan. You said that you were going to try reversing in this time. Honestly, yeah. Like, if you just reverse in, I feel, I feel like that'll kind of solve everything. Okay, just don't fucking park this thing in front of the door. Oh, my God. Okay, just pick up the door, Dylan. Just pick up the door. That's all. Just pick up the door, buddy. Wait, I still can't get into the boat right here. Wait. Okay, well. Okie dokie, game. I'm just going to get the fuck out of here. Yeah, so now pretty much, uh, do I just want to have this, like, here? Do I want to have it over here, kind of? Yep, I'm hearing someone pick cloth right now. Do I want to have this here? I don't know, like, I'm just trying to think how this is all going to be set up. Yeah, I guess it'll just go there. Thankfully, with a tier 2, I can just jump up, and then, yeah, then I can loot up my shit. Okay, cool. Nice. All right. I wonder if I could just take a transit all the way to outpost just with a shitload of stone and just buy wood like that. Maybe I should just do that. I will say... If Outpost is ever gone one day, and I just now saw someone. What's up, dude? Sir, don't. Don't. I would just throw my nade, but I don't want to waste it, guys. Okay, he's going to be dead. A little bit of a sloppy first fight of the wipe, you know? Uh, his name is just Soon, okay. Got a little bit more wood from him, at least. Kind of cool. All right. All right, repair bench can go right there. And then... <coughs> For this, I just need five high coal. Okay. Cool. Got that right there all ready to go. Take out that, take out this. And we actually have a mixing table as well, so... We can even save on charcoal, which will be cool. But... Yeah, so wait, how much how much low grade do I have? 66? Okay, yeah, it's time to go and start cooking at our neighbor's base. There we go. Nice. Now it's like, as this cooks, I kind of feel safe just leaving it there. I'm just going to roam around and look at different bases that I could flame rate and just mark them out on my map. So yeah, first we have this one down here. Let me just come down here because you can see through this door. And we can see if there's a sheet door behind it or not. That's why I just love the people that use these doors. They just, like, they just let me know, like, okay, yeah, this is the only door that leads into here. Which, I don't see anything really in there, but I'm probably still going to raid it. And we got this base right here with a wood door. Cool. Can I get on top of it? Oh, shit, dude, the stone's decaying, but nothing else is. Two small boxes. Okay. Probably going to raid this. Yeah, I'm dipping. I don't know why, but 279 low grade almost doesn't feel like... You know, I'm just going to leave this 105 low grade just going inside there. Fuck it. Oh, oil rig actually got taken. It's off the map. So, I don't know when it's going to be respawning, but hopefully we get to go there. And if not, it's all good. We can just go there tomorrow. I'll be ready to go there tomorrow pretty much all day with, with how prepped up we are now. Yeah, okay. Let's take out this. Take out this. It's going to just make... Eh. I say like yeah, like six Molotovs. Pretty much just going all in with our low grade right now, but we still have a bunch of crude oil that we can cook, so Whoa. Oh no. Ah, I'm doing good man, how are you? Hey man, what's up? Okay, so pretty much here, sir. Sir! Oh my god, sir, do not hit me again. Thank you, thank you for not hitting me again. My nade, it uh, it missed you, and things happened, things escalated. And I, listen, I want to be friends now. 
You can move in. Listen, okay, man. I'm 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 a, I'm a Molotov salesman, okay? I was just showing you my product, and there's nothing to worry about here, okay? Nothing to worry about. I'm the best player in the game, but I'm sick, so it's not showing, okay? That's that's gonna be what I say. Yeah, I think that guy just left, Dylan. Okay. I think that he's just gone. He's just he he's <laughs> he's not putting up with your silly goosery, okay? Just know that. He's out of here. I feel like tomorrow's gonna be a bit more of an eventful day. Today was just kinda like a speed run, getting all the key cards and getting our base set up and whatnot. I am thinking that I wanna go to oil rig, but if it doesn't respawn in time, then I'm then I'm probably not gonna go if it takes too long. Oh no. I wonder if the man himself is out here. <laughs> I should have talked to him with my voice changer because I have the grandma voice on right now and then I could just play off that I'm a grandma and like that I can't see straight. <laughs> oh no, I'm just a grandma. I'm just a grandma. Don't bother me. I was just trying to do the quick f oh, Someone's fucking flame raiding the base that I want to flame raid. Oh my god. And I have two nades. What are the fucking odds? I don't know, but it's someone that has tier 2 gear and everything. Let's just mention that. Take this, take this, take that, take that, take this, take this. Um, Dylan, get out of here now. I don't even know where my Molotovs are at. I'm just, I'm not even going to worry about it this second. I'll, I'll just come back for it, okay? We need this shit. The SAR is really, really big for our oil rig run. Yeah. Dude, I fucking whiffed the first nade. Thankfully, I got the second one in there, though. The first one didn't even go inside the place. Okay. Yeah, let's just get up here real quick. Depot with the SAR. <clears throat> 18 bullets, like really, dude? Why do you gotta hit me with like no ammo? And this guy even had nades himself. Oh shit! I need to get back over there and I need to find my Molotovs because we need to fucking raid that TC in that base. Oh, I know. Then I actually have his backpack. What's all inside the backpack again? I saw like a bunch of mixing tables. Nothing like crazy. I don't know why he has all these fucking things. Like, okay. Like fuck, like the sprinklers, the planter boxes. Like, get this shit out of here. I don't know, I thought that I dropped my mollies, like, up here, like, by this tree. Yeah, here they are. You know, I'm just gonna leave all of them there, except one. He's probably on his way back with, like, a fucking Molotov or some shit for this TC, man. I don't know. Okay, very, very basic bullshit. Yeah, I'm out of here. I just now got like a mini shiver, by the way, just so we all know, okay? My spider senses are tingling. Finally starting to get a little bit of action rolling in here toward the later part of the day. I mean, not that I was like out searching for it to begin with like earlier on, but... Oh shit, dude, this guy ended up fucking stealing my other flame raid! Wait. Oh, he left 500 metal here? Oh, well, thanks. I appreciate that. I guess that I'm gonna get back home, get inside there, get that pump, and just start roaming around pump slug now. I kinda wanna go over toward the satchel raid that I've been hearing. I feel like maybe we could, uh, make some moves over there. I see someone in the comments ask me, how did Shots become your name? So, we had the name Accurate, right? Like, with an E right there, like, I purposely misspelt it back in the day. Then it became Accurate, then it became My Shots Accurate, then it just became Shots. So... Yeah, that's kind of the evolution of my name, and yeah. Yeah, we're, all, uh, we're doing good on GP now, so we're all good there. Let's go ahead and make these slugs, and let's get the fuck out there, man. <laughs> ah, sorry. This cough, man. It's something else. But, uh, yeah, I'm over here, like, running toward where the raid was going down at that I heard, and I have no idea where it would be because I'm just seeing a bunch of massive bases around here. I feel like it might have been on, on, like, this thing right here. Weird enough. <gasps> Wait. Shit, dude, there's this guy right here. With door base right there to my right. Fuck. Wait, no, I actually just now saw him over here jumping around and shit. Yeah, I'm just gonna walk away from this area. I'm really not a fan of this. Like, yeah, no thanks. And Dylan, heal up, by the way. You're only 73 health. You silly-ass goose. Small oil rig isn't respawned yet. That's kind of what I'm waiting for. I'm, I'm gonna go there instantly with, uh, wait, do I have 556 researched on here? I don't, actually. I don't have shit to research it either. Fuck, man. So I think that I would just go pump slug and a SAR. Because I'll get 556 from the bots there and shit, you know?
Arletta, you don't have I can't, I can't, okay, I was gonna say, like, I cannot fucking see this guy. Getting out of here. Jesus, dude, and, like, the leg right there, like, if you look at my FPS, I feel like I was hitting 40s right there. He didn't have any syringes, though. I'm gonna say that's, like, the main reason that I won that, because he wasn't able to fully heal up. One body shot fucking got it done, thankfully. Oh, shit, what's going on up there? I don't even know. I'm just grateful that I won that fight, because I feel like I should have just died. It's these runs right here that are, like, super important. Like, these first few fights that we win, just so we have that safety net, you know, of, of, uh, of gear. Unfortunately, I don't think that I'm gonna be going over to Oil Rig. If it was available right now, I would go. But it hasn't been available for the past like 30 minutes, and, it, and it's not respawning. So, I'm not I'm not even gonna be trying to go there on like some last minute shit or anything. I'm just gonna wait for tomorrow. I think today was like the preparation for it. You know, like we have some gear to use now. We have our key cards. We have a solid base. Yeah, things are gonna be getting wild tomorrow. I'm excited. There's a guy to my left right now that's naked. Oh, no, he's actually mining. Oh shit, dude. Yeah, he's fucking mining. Oh, yeah, and he's using an ice pick, too. I feel like this dude is going to be juiced the fuck out. One minute. Maybe. D just don't tell me that he's only hit, like, two nodes, okay, game? Please. All right, you're dead. Yep, easy. Even a hundred scrap, too, man. Wow, okay. Rest in peace, sir. I'm sorry. <laughs> Okay, so how much metal frags do I have? 845. Okay, if that is all that I have, then I'm actually fucked. Yeah, another 900 there. Another 500 here. And then back here in this box. Nada. Okay, so. Let's upgrade this, this. Like that, that, that. Um, I still have those floors up there, but do I want to do that to high qual? Nah, I guess not. We'll get to it eventually. But, yeah, full sheet vault, tier 2 bench down. We have some guns to fall back on for tomorrow. Uh, we have key cards grinded up. So, yeah. This was a pretty good startup. I enjoyed today. It was chill, but fun. Now I'm just thinking about, uh, let me just take this out, put that there. Put a thousand wood there. And then same shit here. Yeah. And then as soon as we get on, we'll have this 600 uh, metal cooked up, which will be nice. Maybe I could just get this entire thing done right now and I think about it. Wait, do I have a uh, window research? Oh yeah, nice dude, I actually do. Nice, okay. Yeah, we can get this entire outside bit finished right now. And then back here for the honeycomb, of course, we can... Like that, that, that. Nice, there we go. that down right there yeah i'm just gonna be finishing up a couple things here and i will see you tomorrow tomorrow the very first thing that i'm gonna be thinking about is going over to oil rig i don't know if it's gonna be available or not but uh yeah this is meant to be kind of like an oil rig wipe so we'll uh we'll see how much pvp we're getting into there how many fights we're winning how many fights we're losing yeah we'll see so i'll see you then if you made it here to the end of this video comment the word oil thank you for joining me today and i will of course see you tomorrow for a new beautiful day so uh yeah bye